This will be India's first four-level transportation corridor. And this 80-meter-long giant open-web structural steel span, weighing 1,650 metric tons, has been erected for its construction in just two months. More than 150 trains and over 1 lakh vehicles pass this metro construction site every day. It is part of India's longest double-decker metro viaduct. Launching of this 18.9 meter wide steel girder across a live railway track at a height of 28 meters is a first for Indian railways. And the erection of this gigantic superstructure across a live railway track could be the fastest in Indian metro construction history. Phase 1 of Nagpur Metro consists of two elevated corridors north south and east west with a total length of 39 kilometers afghans is constructing 17.1 kilometers which is almost 44 percent of the total viaduct length and around 51 percent of overall civil works in both the corridors reach 2 in the north south corridor stretches from sita buldi interchange station to automotive square station for a total length of 6.67 kilometers in it 5.3 kilometers consists of a double decker metro cum nagi viaduct which is the longest in the country this one of its kind viaduct structure consists of flyover and metro spans supported on single piers two solid approach ramps a 44 meter obligatory steel pan and an 80-meter steel span over Gaddi Godam railway crossing. The construction of this revolutionary four-level transportation corridor is the most unique feature in Reach 2 of Nagpur Metro. Initially, when we planned, we thought that this is next to impossible to complete within even five months. Earlier, our plan was to complete with only one work front. We opened four work fronts that enabled us to squeeze our entire five months into two months period and our entire team was able to deliver their targets within time around the clock. We used heavy duty cranes ranging from 500 ton to 300 ton. We have used super lift 500 ton crane which enabled us to lift the component of the flyover one by one. The biggest challenge was to erect entire truss in a sequential manner. The truss was divided in three parts to expedite the erections. The major challenge was to erect the entire truss with the accuracy of plus minus five only. We could able to complete entire erection with the accuracy of plus three mm. Our camber adjustment was more than the required theoretical dimensions. Besides the double-decker metro viaduct in Reach 2, Afghans has also constructed the Sita Buldi station which serves as an interchange. It is the highest metro interchange station in India. The second critical and major station in the stretch is the Gaddi Godam station. It has two basement parkings and ground plus five floors. The total floor area is 14,400 square meters. The section between Sita Buldi Interchange and Zero Mile Station was critical and had to be constructed on priority. Since the inauguration of Reach 1 depended on its quick delivery, Afghan's engineers completed construction and delivered this stretch 211 days ahead of schedule. Besides the double-decker corridor, Afghans is also constructing eight stations in Reach 1 and Reach 2, along with two depots. In the East-West Corridor, or Reach 3, an 11-kilometer viaduct from Jhansi Rani Square to Lokmanya Nagar was completed in a record time of 28 months. 
370 spans were launched in just 20 months with a record peak progress of 30 spans in a single month. 3,456 segments were cast in just 20 months. We wanted us to be differentiated on extreme engineering and construction, so the organization was systematically built on this DNA. Over a period of time, we invested substantial time, money and resources to build up these capabilities within the system and now it has become a way of life. So it's something our people uh, enjoy and uh, they excel at. In fact, uh, the more the challenges, the more the involvement from the teams come. Nagpur Metro has been one of our best performing metros. Uh, one for our own uh, team's uh, efforts and uh, involvement and competence. And the clients were also very active to get the job done on time. So there was a lot of synergy between the contractor and the client. AFCONS achieved 10 million safe man hours without any lost time incident and received the Safe Civil Contractor Award from Maha Metro. The company has received several commendations for completion of the priority corridor in Reach 2 and outstanding performance in Viaduct Works. The entire successful completion of this railway span was possible because the immense support and contribution given by the client, various designers, our other stakeholders, the Nagpurians, the shop owners which are there in the nearby areas and police authority of the Nagpur within 25 months associated and could construct this four level transport system which is the first time in India. There were many complexities, challenges in the construction of Nagpur Metro and I am happy to mention AFCONS exhibited extreme engineering to complete the project successfully and to the satisfaction of the client. The four level transportation corridor is a remarkable piece of metro infrastructure that will not only revolutionize urban transportation in Nagpur but will also become a solution for other Indian cities in the future. So this I would rate it as one of our top two or best performing metro projects. Basically when you undertake such very challenging tasks, first you need to bring in a very competent team. You have to assemble a warlike team which was done here and uh, the CMG was involved in the process to simplify the whole operation and the clients were uh, roped in so that you know they could work in tandem with us and then a commitment which is uh, part of our DNA to get things done at the leadership level at the site. All these elements put together, we could do that. Mahametro and AFCONS have provided inspiring solutions and have created impressive landmarks in construction of Nagpur Metro Phase 1.